All right, this relic is just easily the best relic in the entire game. It is like game changing for so many mutant characters, man. And yeah, I thought I'd just show you how much of a difference this relic makes for like so many characters. So yeah, right here we have Namor, um, my rank five Namor, my beloved. <laughs> uh, yeah, so Namor, I love the guy so much, right? But I do admit he isn't like a perfect character because he doesn't like have any way to like get increased crit rating. And if you don't crit on the SP2 or SP1, it does kind of hurt him for sure. So yeah, first let's see how much uh, we crit with like just no relic on, just regular SP2 and regular SP1. So we're about to do the SP2, and it gets one crit of 103,000. The rest doesn't crit at all. Then we drop the SP1, and yet again, no crits. So that's one crit out of like seven hits, I believe. And now let's see what it looks like with the relic. So here we drop the SP3, and you're just going to see how much it like changes these characters because 2000 crit rate goes a long way like it really does go a long way for so many champions you're gonna see just how like impactful it is so you drop the sp2 no crit there one crit there and then a massive 200,000 crit but that's like not fair right? that was only three hits so let's see how he does against like seven hits right with the relic and you're gonna see it still makes a massive difference because keep in mind the first time we tried it we only crit on one hit so let's see how it does when there's eight hits to land crits on, right? So let's see how he does here. We drop the SP2 and yeah, all hits crit there. Then we drop the SP1 and three out of five hits crit there. So that was about six out of eight crits compared to the one out of eight crits on like the fight without the relic. That is insane, man. That is absolutely insane. And now we have Colossus who is known for just not critting. Like that's his main drawback. He just does not crit whatsoever. But um, yeah, with the relic, things change for sure so there we only got one crit which is just you know that's usual for colossus honestly it's more common to get zero crits right and now we drop the sp2 with the relic and the first one right here we get two crits which is pretty like that's still pretty good that's an improvement for sure but then look at this last sp2 man the last sp2 is just craziness so we drop the heavy attack does some pretty nice damage you know colossus he is a damage monster right so of course he's gonna do a ton of damage so here i dropped sp2 after this last heavy attack forty-one thousand crit by the way and look at this damage man all critical hits just absolute insanity and that is why colossus is just insane with this relic now we have domino as well she gets all crits there then we have danny moonstar who is brand new and she's gonna do like pretty much every hit as a critical hit the only hit that didn't crit is the energy damage attack and you know energy damage attacks aren't like counted towards this like relic ability so yeah it doesn't even matter but yeah look at that all crits just some beautiful damage output and yeah man this relic is just crazy good uh yeah let me know your thoughts on this relic it works for like gambit sunspot partially just a lot of different characters and it is by far the best relic in the game and uh, yeah it's about it for me